So in my last video I showed the process how to order this TMC2209 development board I just um, created in KiCad and this is what it actually does and how it works. So this is an Arduino shield that can be plugged on top of an Arduino Uno or Mega um, and uses a TMC2209 stepper motor driver from Trinamic to drive stepper motors. And the special thing about the TMC2209 and 08 and 2210, I think, is that you can control them via UART, so you don't have to, like in the A49, I think, 88, 22, I don't know these old stepper, uh, stepper driver chips, um, you don't have to interface with, uh, with them via step and direction pins, but you can also use UART. And in my case, I can use a software, software serial from the Arduino on pin um, 9 and 10. So it makes it super easy to interface with this chip. And because I'm currently working on this um, EtherSweep controller project and switching from the TMC2208 to the 09 controller uh, chip, um, I decided to build this development board and yeah what this actually does it, it breaks out all the important pins from, pins from the TMC09 <laughs> from the TMC2209 to the Arduino pins so I can play around and test different modes and settings and the software serial interface and the step direction interface and addressing and theoretically can use multiple TMCs on the same serial bus and everything. And just after I received the, the boards, um, I only had to assemble the THD components, which are the pin headers and the XC30 connector, because all the other components are already SMT assembled from my manufacturer, which is quite nice because I don't have to solder them by hand. Um, so this is what I'm doing here, just soldering the pins and the XT30 connector. And I think one really cool design decision was to add mounting holes for the stepper motor so I don't have to build like a wood construction or something or put the stepper motor on my desk while testing. So I can just screw in this, um, I think it's 31 by 31 millimeters grid. Um, so I can directly screw in the stepper motor from the backside, put it on top of the shield and plug the shield into the Arduino. So it's quite a compact form factor to test. And this is actually quite a like a low budget or a low 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 tech version of the Ether Sweep controller. Actually, it's only the controller part anyway. So I can test, uh, for example, the sensorless homing and all the other stuff the TMC twenty two zero nine offers via this new UART interface. And I think this is quite cool. And if you like it, you can download and order the assembly files and the keycard files and then you can send it to a manufacturer and get it manufactured yourself and i think the cost is around i think 50 euros for five pieces for um yeah for five assembled boards and you only have to solder uh, the xc30 connector and the pin headers and the motor you have to get yourself and some of these standoff pins but yeah i think for less than 100 euros you get a pretty solid base to start with the tmc2209 and I think because there is basically no um, test board or development board or shield or something for an Arduino and the TMC2209, I think this is a good starting point if you want to have motion control for your project and don't want to use these A49, what was it, 88 or 22 or the RV8825 or something chips because the TMCs are way better than these old rusty chips. Yeah, and the TMC chips are also pretty strong and pretty fast. So anyway, these are pretty cool. And the code and everything is in the description and you can download and download it and play with it. And if you like, you can leave a like or subscription or comment if you have some questions or anything. So thank you. Bye.